Hello kids. Today I am going to tell you another Panchatantra story. And today's story is titled The Lion and the Rabbit. Once upon a time in the jungle lived a menacing lion. In order to satisfy his hunger, the lion used to eat a lot of animals. All the animals in the jungle were afraid of him. Due to his fear, no animal felt safe in the jungle. The animals had consistent fear of getting killed by the lion at any time of the day. The animals were extremely worried that if the lion prevailed to kill animals at the same rate, there will be no animal left for him to hunt. To figure out a solution, the animals gathered for a meeting. My friends, this is a tough time for us. If the lion continues to hunt and eat like this, then that day isn't far when none of us will be left alive. This cruel lion ate my wife. Keep calm, my friend. We have to do something at all costs. We need to teach him a lesson. Friends, I will meet the lion tomorrow and we'll talk about this. We might come to a conclusion. Next day, the fox went to meet the lion and said, My king, you are the ruler of this jungle and we are your subjects. If you will kill all of us, then who will you rule? The lion began to think. We have a solution for this. From tomorrow onwards, one of us will come to you as your food. Only if you agree to this. Alright. But do remember that due to any reason if this streak ends, then I will begin to hunt you all again. Don't worry, my king. You will never need to complain. Saying so, the fox went away. From that day onwards, one animal used to sacrifice itself to the lion every day. The lion was likewise relieved as he didn't have to go and hunt animals. After a few days, it was the turn of a rabbit to feed itself to the lion. The rabbit didn't want to sacrifice itself to the lion. An idea came through its mind. The rabbit slowly, slowly went to the lion. The lion was eagerly waiting for the rabbit. As soon as the rabbit reached, it said, Why are you so angry, my king? Please, please don't be mad at me. The thing is, the fox sent me here with five other rabbits as your supper. On the way, a cruel lion killed the other five rabbits. I somehow managed to survive and come here. The lion got very angry as he listened to the rabbit. The lion roared and said to the rabbit, Tell me who snatched my food. Tell me who dared to snatch my food. I pleaded multiple times not to snatch away my king's food. I told him that it can make my king severely angry. But the other lion didn't listen. The lion lost his temper as he continued to listen to the rabbit. The lion reverted the rabbit angrily. Take me to that lion immediately. I am going to kill him. There is just one king of this jungle and I am the one. Let's go, my king. The rabbit took the lion to a well and said, My king, that lion is hiding inside this well. The lion looked inside the well and replied to his own reflection, mistaking it as the other lion. So you are the one who has snatched away my food? I am going to kill you. Lion's voice echoed inside the well. As a result, it escalated his anger. Without a second thought, the lion jumped inside the well. And after some time, he had a painful death. When the rabbit informed the other animals that the lion has died, everyone applauded his intellect and mindfulness. All the animals had begin to live happily again. So kids, from this story, we learn a lesson that wisdom is stronger than physical strength. If you enjoyed this video, do like, share and comment. And to be the first person to watch our videos, make sure to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for timely notifications.